What's up, everybody? It's the homie Truth Teller, the street reporter. We got the legend back up in here and the official Truth Teller TV legend. How you doing, young? Chilling like a villain. Um, most definitely. It's always a pleasure to have you come through here. I'm not sure if a lot of people realize, but FBG helped a lot of bloggers in this shit. You know, it's other groups too, you know, the old blocks, the Glow Games, but I feel like a lot of bloggers kind of blew up with promoting you guys and posting you guys. Do you feel like that too? I don't know what you can say. Mm. Do you feel y'all swagger? You know, the shit that y'all laid down, the groundwork. Do you feel that? Do you see it in the music game? You see swagger jacking and shit like that? I don't know. You, you probably could say that a couple years ago. It's a whole it's a whole new generation, a whole new style. Right. Right. You know, it's being like a veteran in this drill shit. Even though you told me several times you don't consider yourself a drill rapper. But being a veteran in this shit, do you see the drill culture moving forward? Do you feel like it's dying out? I don't know. I don't know what I can say about that shit. I don't know. I don't know. That shit still getting motherfuckers rich. Yeah. Right. Shit it seemed what it now to me because everybody doing the same shit, but shit. People still getting rich off. Right. You know, somebody said that it ain't too many people kind of blew up off the drill rap. What do you say about that? Because I do see like Keith, Herbo, King Von, like Duck. But it is a lot of guys that didn't really take the baton and go far with it. What do you think about that? Me, I look at it like shit. Then everybody blew up off the drill rap. Okay. Shit. If they ain't blow up to the extent where motherfuckers wanted to be shit, they taking care of their family off that shit. They done they got it. They getting a check off that shit. They ain't got to have a job. No, that's a fact. Niggas went to the same house shit in the trenches. That's true. So you have seen this drill change people's lives and shit like this. Yeah, for sure. All right. Young, I want to ask you this question, because, you know, you're a legend in this shit, and this new fans jumped in the coach. It seemed like a bunch of new fans that jumped in this shit within the last week, to be honest. You know, from people who don't realize this, in your opinion, like, when it comes to the drill culture shit, did you see it getting to this point where a lot of people would be gone? Because you was here when it was a lot of rappers still alive and shit, y'all. Did you see this when you first was in this rap shit? Like, yeah, this shit gonna get violent. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Shit, I mean, shit. It's regular neighborhood shit. It's how it always mm. ends up. It's how it was the generation before us. It's how it was the generation before them. Only a handful of niggas made it out the shit. No, that's true. You know, a lot of people don't know. I tell my son and I tell other people, you know, when I grew up young, you know, as a teenager and young, I didn't have a lot of dead friends, young. You know, I didn't have a lot of homies that passed away. I can probably count one, maybe. You know, you know a lot of people that passed away. Young, that don't hunt you to this day? What you mean, hunt you? Like, you know, it don't hunt you knowing you didn't been at barbecues and all kind of shit. I consider you a veteran in this shit, bro. Like, what are you trying to say? Because a lot of these like, guys ain't here no like more. Some, you got a lot of memories about them? Yeah, for sure. You think about shit every day. Hunt like some scary shit, though. Right, I may I use the wrong word, but like I know, I know you have memories of it. You knew all these people we talk about. You knew Tuka, you knew Ki, Rick, Duck, Kobe. Yeah, yeah. that's crazy, man. You know, I just wanted to start that off because a lot of people don't know that. You know, this drill game they portray the drill rap game is very dangerous. What do you say about the image they put on this shit, y'all? I mean, shit, I don't know. It's real life. What you mean? Drill rap was just what they call it. It's like, to niggas who doing that shit, is reality. Right. No, I get it. I get it. I just wanted to ask you that, you know, every time I get a chance to talk to one of the main players in this shit, I want to ask him. I kind of want to jump right into it. That was our warm-up, though, Young. You know, we can jump right into it. I came from, I know you know I want to ask you about this, Young. A video of King Lil J leaked on the internet. You know, it looked like he was sitting on a bench. Kind of looked like a, I don't know, maybe like a gay man was, you know, came and sat on his lap, allegedly, and things like that. What's the first thing that came to your head when you seen that video? Yeah. Shit. Shit is the video. What you, what you want to come to my head? Street time. I'm saying, was you shocked when you seen, like, you know, or you wanted the guys to say that when King Lil J? I don't really want to talk about Lil J though, cause like I get it. You did. I, I totally understand that. 
I totally get that. You know, <laughs> I seen that going viral. There's no way I couldn't ask you about that. Um, King Von video is going viral. Yeah, 